Hi, my name is Adam. This is a 1970 Volkswagen van, and I need to pull out the uh, windshield wiper assembly because I believe it has frozen. I turned on the windshield wipers, and the car immediately died. Uh, so the car was uh, was running. Uh, I had warmed it up uh, the other day, and uh, uh, needed to uh, clean the uh, uh, the moisture off the windows, off the windshield, and uh, Turned on the windshield wiper and the car immediately died. And uh, a buddy, Barry from Barry's Volkswagen, Barry's Boneyard, sorry, Barry's Boneyard in Huntington Beach said, Oh, Adam, I guarantee you that's your, um, that's your windshield wipers being frozen. So what you need to do is you need to get in there and loosen them up. Uh, so this is a, a video on how to do that. Now there's a gentleman on the internet that's already uh, done this. Uh, he's already got one. So I'll uh, see if I can make mine a little quicker than his. What I have done is I have taken uh, a vice grip and one of these little uh, gizmos, right? A uh, um, Phillips head. And you want to put it at this kind of angle. So that way you can get in here at an angle and loosen it up. This, this screw that went in here was super tight and it was very difficult to remove. So I, I, I couldn't do it with just a normal screwdriver. And even, even if I had a normal screwdriver, I still couldn't get enough uh, strength uh, in there uh, to do so. So uh, I pulled that sucker out, right? There it is, okay? And that allowed me, oh, you're gonna wanna have your glove compartment out and probably the radio. Um, I didn't have a radio or glove compartment anyway. So that allowed me to remove the piece of tubing that went over here. All right, I was able to get that out, and then I didn't, I did not need to pull out this side. I didn't need to loosen up those screws on that side. I was able to pull the whole contraption down. Then I took this rag, which was white, <laughs> it was perfectly white, and I wiped down everything in here. This is all covered in dirt and gunk and stuff like that. It was just horrible, dirty and dusty. And of course, prior to that, you can see I've got some junk up here right now. I, um, I cleaned off the uh, dash, uh, put everything in a box. Uh, now, uh, what else I've done so far is I've come around to the front and I have removed the windshield wiper from here and over there. And all that took was, um, whoops, I dropped the screwdriver. That's great. And all that took was a screwdriver here but behind that I, I, I levered the screwdriver against here uh, and that allowed me to, to pull the assembly out to pull out the assembly then it looks like there's these little gizmos here uh, to take off the windshield wiper I just used a little adjustable wrench the next step I'm gonna do I believe is uh, is loosen up this uh, this nut here see all the crap I have in my dash I had to clean that off um, and then I will pull the entire assembly probably actually I think first I'm gonna check to make sure this will will will, will turn uh, the guys at the Volkswagen shop seem to think that these might be frozen now I can see why they might think that because look at all this rust so water's gotten in there from sprinklers and things and is probably uh, why this is this is all frozen and then I'll pull the whole assembly out if need be I've got some uh, grease and uh, don't keep sugar on your dashboard if you go to the uh, coffee shop Starbucks and tracks ants or ants crawling along my dash the other day okay put down these looks like there's a white washer here okay put that down looks like there's a washer we'll fill Phillips head screwdriver in there. There we go. And that whole assembly is going to go out. Let me pause this. All right, now let's zoom in here under the dash. It looks like, so that's the arm, right? It looks like this whole kit and caboodle is being held in by this nut or bolt or whatever that is. See that? Here's another problem. 
This wire I can pull off, but this is attached. And I don't know if I really want to go through all the hassle of pulling this whole assembly out here. Of, of disconnecting this here. Just so I can get to the assembly. And it looks like this all gets wired into the, uh, well, of course, that's where all the wiring goes. Into the um, windshield wiper assembly. So I'm going to try to do this without pulling everything completely.